China has been actively engaged in modernizing its armored forces, and one notable trend is the development of smaller, smarter, and stealthier tanks that deviate from the traditional design concepts of main battle tanks MBTs. These new generation tanks are designed to meet the evolving requirements of modern warfare, emphasizing mobility, agility, and advanced technology integration. China's new tank prototypes showcase a range of advanced technologies, innovative design philosophies, and unique characteristics that set them apart from existing tank models. These prototypes are designed to address the challenges of modern warfare and reflect China's ambition to modernize its armored forces. Before we begin with this intriguing story, we appreciate that you can subscribe to our channel so that we can bring you more content similar to this one. Thank you so much for your support. Let's continue. Here are the key characteristics of China's new tank prototypes. 1. Lightweight and Agile Design Many of China's new tank prototypes feature a lightweight and compact design, significantly reducing their overall weight compared to traditional main battle tanks MBTs. This design philosophy prioritizes mobility and agility, allowing the tanks to navigate through diverse terrains, including urban areas, with greater ease. Examples of such prototypes include the Vermont 5, also known as MBT-3000, and the VT-4, MBT-3000S, which are considerably lighter than older Chinese MBTs like the Type 99 and Type 96. 2. Stealth and Low Profile Chinese tank designers are focusing on reducing the tank's visual, thermal, and radar signatures. New prototypes often have angular shapes, sloped armor, and composite materials to minimize their radar cross-section RCS. The use of advanced camouflage techniques, including adaptive camouflage systems, further enhances their ability to blend into various environments, making them harder to detect and target. 3. Advanced Sensors and Fire Control Systems China's new tank prototypes are equipped with state-of-the-art sensor suites, including thermal imagers, laser rangefinders, and advanced fire control computers. These sensors provide improved target acquisition, tracking, and engagement capabilities, even in adverse weather conditions or at night. Some prototypes feature automated target tracking and fire control systems, reducing the reaction time required for engaging enemy targets. 4. Modular Armor and Active Protection Systems APS, Chinese tank prototypes often incorporate modular armor designs, allowing for easy upgrades and customization. This modularity enables the tanks to adapt to different threat environments by adding or removing armor modules. APS, such as the GL5 Active Defense System, is integrated into some prototypes. These systems can detect and intercept incoming threats like anti-tank missiles and rocket-propelled grenades significantly improving tank survivability. 5. Unmanned turrets and remote-controlled weapon stations Several Chinese tank prototypes feature unmanned turrets or remotely operated weapon stations. This design removes the need for a human loader and allows the crew to operate from within the protected hull. The Vermont 4, for example, has a remotely controlled weapon station that can be armed with various weapons, enhancing crew safety and enabling the tank to engage targets while remaining concealed. 6. Advanced Ammunition and Autoloaders China's new tank prototypes are designed to use advanced ammunition, including high-velocity armor-piercing rounds and precision-guided munitions. These munitions offer improved accuracy and penetration capabilities. Some prototypes are equipped with automatic loading systems, autoloaders, that reduce crew size and increase the rate of fire, allowing for rapid engagement of multiple targets. 7. Hybrid and Electric Propulsion China is exploring hybrid and electric propulsion systems for its tank prototypes. These systems can provide smoother acceleration, quieter operation, and potentially reduced thermal signatures. Electric drives may also enable tanks to move in stealth mode for short distances, making them harder to detect. 8. Network-centric capabilities. Chinese tank prototypes are designed to operate within a network-centric warfare framework. 
They are equipped with advanced communication systems that enable real-time data sharing with other military assets, such as drones, infantry units, and command centers. This connectivity enhances situational awareness, facilitates coordinated strikes, and enables rapid decision-making on the battlefield. 9. Amphibious and All-Terrain Mobility Some Chinese tank prototypes, like the VT-5, have amphibious capabilities, allowing them to swim across water obstacles without requiring external support. Additionally, these tanks are designed to navigate various terrains, including rugged landscapes and urban environments, ensuring tactical flexibility. 10. Comparison to existing models. Compared to older Chinese MBTs like the Type 99 and Type 96, the new prototypes are generally lighter, more agile, and stealthier. They incorporate more advanced technologies and are designed to be more modular and adaptable. In terms of global competitors, China's new tank prototypes aim to compete with modern Western and Russian designs, offering a balance between mobility, firepower, and protection. The focus on technology integration and network-centric warfare is a notable aspect of China's approach. China's new tank prototypes represent a significant leap forward in terms of technology and design, emphasizing mobility, stealth, and adaptability. These prototypes are designed to meet the evolving demands of modern warfare, where agility, survivability, and integration with other military systems are crucial. As China continues to refine and test these prototypes, they are likely to play a significant role in shaping the future of the country's armored forces and influencing global tank design trends. As military technology evolves, traditional tank designs face challenges in versatility, mobility, and survivability on the modern battlefield. The Ukraine-Russia war has had a significant impact on the perception of conventional tanks' effectiveness and has provided valuable insights into modern armored warfare. The conflict has highlighted both the strengths and vulnerabilities of tanks, influencing how military strategists and defense industries approach tank design, deployment, and tactics. Here's how the Ukraine-Russia war has changed the understanding of conventional tanks' effectiveness. 1. Urban Warfare Challenges The urban warfare environment in Ukraine has presented significant challenges for tanks. Narrow streets, high-rise buildings, and urban clutter provide ample opportunities for ambushes and the use of anti-tank weapons, such as portable rocket-propelled grenades, RPGs, and anti-tank guided missiles, ATGMs. Tanks operating in urban areas are more vulnerable to ambushes from infantry armed with anti-tank weapons. This has led to a re-evaluation of tank tactics in urban warfare, emphasizing combined arms operations with infantry support and the use of unmanned vehicles for reconnaissance. 2. Anti-tank weapon proliferation. The conflict has witnessed a widespread use of advanced anti-tank weapons by both Ukrainian and Russian forces. Ukraine received significant supplies of Western-made ATGMs, such as the Javelin and NLAW, which have proven highly effective against Russian armor. This proliferation of advanced ATGMs has underscored the vulnerability of tanks, especially when operating without adequate infantry support and air defense. It has prompted discussions on how to enhance tank survivability through active protection systems APS, improved situational awareness, and better crew training. 3. Importance of Combined Arms and Joint Operations The war has demonstrated the critical importance of combined arms and joint operations. Tanks are most effective when operating in conjunction with infantry, artillery, air support, and electronic warfare assets. Coordinated strikes involving multiple military branches have proven more successful than isolated tank assaults. This underscores the need for integrated battlefield management and the synergy of various military assets. 4. Survivability and Protection The conflict has highlighted the importance of tank survivability and protection. Tanks with advanced armor, APS, and well-trained crews have shown higher survival rates. Some modern tank designs, like the Ukrainian T-84 Oplot and the Russian T-90M, have demonstrated better protection against various anti-tank threats. This has led to discussions on upgrading existing tank fleets and developing new designs with enhanced protection. 
5. Mobility and Agility Tanks with superior mobility and agility have proven to be more effective in the dynamic battlefield environment of Ukraine. The ability to quickly reposition, maneuver, and exploit weak points in enemy defenses has been crucial. This has prompted a re-evaluation of tank mobility requirements, including the need for lighter and more agile designs that can navigate urban and rugged terrains more effectively. 6. Intelligence, Surveillance, and Reconnaissance ISR, Effective ISR capabilities have been vital for both sides in the conflict. Drones and unmanned aerial vehicles UAVs, have played a significant role in identifying enemy positions, guiding artillery strikes, and providing real-time battlefield intelligence. Tanks equipped with advanced sensors and networked with ISR assets have a distinct advantage. This has led to a growing emphasis on integrating tanks into a broader network-centric warfare environment. 7. Logistics and Maintenance The war has underscored the importance of logistics and maintenance in sustaining armored operations. Both sides have faced challenges in maintaining and repairing damaged tanks, highlighting the need for robust supply chains and field repair capabilities. The ability to quickly recover and repair damaged tanks can significantly impact their overall effectiveness in prolonged conflicts. 8. Psychological Impact and Morale Tanks remain powerful symbols of military might, and their presence on the battlefield can have a significant psychological impact on both enemy forces and civilian populations. Well-coordinated tank operations can boost the morale of friendly forces and demoralize the enemy, influencing the overall course of battles. The Ukraine-Russia war has served as a real-world testing ground for conventional tanks, revealing both their strengths and weaknesses. It has emphasized the need for a holistic approach to armored warfare, including combined arms tactics, technological advancements, and the integration of tanks into a broader network-centric military strategy. The conflict has also highlighted the importance of adaptability, situational awareness, and the ability to counter modern anti-tank threats. As a result, tank design and doctrine are likely to evolve, with a renewed focus on survivability, mobility, and the integration of advanced technologies to enhance their effectiveness on the modern battlefield. The key insight that emerges from China's new tank prototypes is that they could revolutionize ground combat by emphasizing adaptability and stealth, significantly altering the dynamics of military engagements in several profound ways. 1. Enhanced Tactical Flexibility The new tank prototype's lightweight and agile design allows for greater tactical flexibility in various combat scenarios. Their smaller size and improved mobility enable them to navigate through urban environments, rugged terrains, and other challenging landscapes more effectively. This adaptability means that armored units can deploy and maneuver more swiftly, exploiting weak points in enemy defenses and responding quickly to changing battlefield conditions. The ability to operate in diverse terrains can provide a strategic advantage, allowing for more effective flanking maneuvers and surprise attacks. 2. Reduced Detectability and Stealth Capabilities China's focus on reducing the tank's visual, thermal, and radar signatures is a game-changer in modern warfare. Stealth technology, including angular shapes, composite materials, and advanced camouflage, makes these tanks harder to detect and target. With reduced detectability, enemy forces will have less time to react and engage the tanks, increasing the element of surprise. This is particularly crucial in an era where advanced surveillance and precision-guided weapons pose significant threats to traditional armored formations. 3. Network-Centric Warfare Integration These new tank prototypes are designed to be integral components of a network-centric warfare environment. Their advanced communication systems enable seamless data sharing with other military assets, such as drones, infantry, and command centers. This integration enhances situational awareness, allowing tank crews to make more informed decisions and coordinate their actions with other units. Real-time intelligence sharing can lead to more precise and effective strikes, improving overall battlefield efficiency. 4. Modular Design and Rapid Adaptation The modular design philosophy employed in these prototypes enables rapid adaptation to changing mission requirements. 
Modular armor systems allow for easy upgrades and customization, ensuring that tanks can be tailored for specific threats or environments. This adaptability extends to weapon systems, sensors, and protection technologies. Tanks can be quickly reconfigured for different roles, such as urban warfare, anti-tank missions, or infantry support, without requiring a complete redesign. 5. Unmanned and Optionally Manned Operations The introduction of unmanned and optionally manned tank platforms is a significant innovation. These vehicles can operate autonomously or be remotely controlled, reducing the risk to human crews in high-threat areas. Unmanned tanks can perform reconnaissance, act as decoys, or engage targets, providing a force multiplier effect. They can also gather intelligence and conduct surveillance without exposing human soldiers to danger. 6. Changing the dynamics of armored warfare. The combination of adaptability, stealth, and advanced technology in these new tanks could shift the dynamics of armored warfare. Traditional tank engagements, characterized by long-range firepower exchanges, may become less common as tanks become more difficult to detect and target. Instead, ground combat might involve more dynamic and decentralized operations, with tanks operating in conjunction with drones, infantry, and other assets as part of a networked force. This could lead to more fluid and unpredictable battlefields, requiring a higher degree of coordination and situational awareness. 7. Influence on Adversary Strategies The introduction of these advanced tanks could force adversaries to rethink their anti-armor strategies. The reduced detectability and increased survivability of these tanks may render traditional anti-tank weapons and tactics less effective. As a result, opponents may need to invest in more advanced anti-tank technologies, such as long-range precision-guided missiles, drones, and electronic warfare systems, to counter the new generation of Chinese tanks. 8. Global Impact on Tank Design and Procurement China's innovative approach to tank design could influence global trends in armored vehicle development. Other nations may follow suit, emphasizing adaptability, stealth, and technology integration in their future tank programs. This shift could lead to a new era of tank warfare, where traditional heavy MBTs coexist with lighter, more agile, and technologically advanced designs, each tailored to specific roles and mission requirements. China's new tank prototypes have the potential to revolutionize ground combat by emphasizing adaptability, stealth, and technology integration. These innovations could significantly alter the way armored units operate, making them more versatile, survivable, and effective in modern and future battlefields. The changing dynamics of military engagements might require a re-evaluation of traditional armored warfare strategies, not only in China but also among its allies and adversaries, shaping the future of ground combat worldwide. If you like the content in this episode, please also check out our other videos on this channel and subscribe for more updates on China's military technology and development. That's all we have for now, and thank you for tuning in. We hope you enjoy this episode. If you like our content, please subscribe to our channel, like and share our video. We will bring you more content similar to this one. Thank you for watching and we look forward to seeing you in our next video.